Today I'll be simulating the 2024 NBA playoffs, but instead of current day squads and stars battling it out, I've replaced them all with legendary all-time teams. That means MVP candidate Shea Gilgis Alexander will now be running with young Kevin Durant, prime Russell Westbrook, I, I mean that's a stacked squad, but he'll also potentially be running into um, pr prime Kobe Bryant, Shaquille O'Neal, Magic Johnson, in, in addition to LeBron and AD on the all-time Lakers, so yeah, that could get ugly. Uh, how much will the current day playoff seeding affect which all-time team will be the last one standing? Well, there is truly only one way to find out. Let's go. By the time you're seeing this video, the first round of play-in matchups have been completed. That's where we will start. And let's do it, man. This is a mismatch of epic proportions in terms of their all-time teams, but in a one... Wow, look, look at the all-time Pelicans. That Well, they did have a big lead. Not anymore. Okay, third quarter. They're still in this game. LA, are you, are you choking? And I should mention now, instead of every time we load into a game, in order to make this video to set up this playoff simulation. Um, it's a long story, but most of the courts that these games will be taking place on don't make sense with the teams that are playing. It's just when you do custom jerseys and rosters, 2K glitches out. L let's just roll with it, okay? No, I don't think I will. For example, um, this game, which is inexplicably close, the Lakers might be choking, the Pelicans might do this. Uh, the game is being played on the LA Clippers home court. I don't know why Shaq, oh, that was almost a huge stop for the all-time Pels. We're just gonna have to roll with it with the courts, though. It's just just did a 2kb glitch and anyways i will also stop talking about it right now cp3 do you have any magic in ad getting boxed in the clutch drew going to the pick and roll with zion okay okay one stop here one stop pels and a rebound jerry west is missing that he's missing that but where's the rebound 80 80 no ooh, ooh, ooh. he got george mike and up out of here cp3 as Shaq switched out onto him he's gonna take him inside yes sir no free throws but he makes it over george mike and that's a tough finish chris paul is absolutely built for this moment Okay, okay. So Anthony Davis is now guarding Shaq. Uh, I don't love that matchup, but it's better than Zion. I bring that up because I could tell right away, yep, they're going into Shaq. They're going, ugh, no. No defense from AD. Now seven and a half seconds left. The Lakers went early, which is interesting. Oh, oh, they're trying to let AD get it back. AD floater over Shaq. That's tough. And there is no upset here today. There was, however, a, a rather large upset, a shocking upset as in our second West play in game. Sacramento dominated. Golden State. Bruh, I, I, I know 13 points doesn't seem like, like a lot. All-time Sacramento was up by so much in this game. I don't know how. Technically, they had home court advantage, even though this game is in Dallas. Maybe that was the difference? Because how does this 99 wilt uh, Kevin Durant, Steph Curry... How does this do? Come on. Come on. In the, oh, that's why. One game, anything can happen. And I mean, uh, I, I guess Sacramento's no slouches either. Oscar, Jerry Lucas around uh, Demontis Sabonis, De'Aaron Fox. Golden State definitely better on paper, but that's the chaos of the play in GG. Wow, you were such a good dog, Winnie. Okay, wait. If you think people should sign up for underdog using code JCAN, then go, dog. Go. Yeah. You might not believe me, but if I wouldn't have said that, she wouldn't have run out the door. She really believes you should use code JCAN. I mean, I don't know what to tell. You see the important info right, right, right over there. It, it's all good stuff, man. The NBA playoffs, the NHL playoffs, MLB, it's all happening right now. There has never been a better time to sign up for Underdog. Use code JCAN at checkout. Link and all other info is down below. They'll match your first deposit up to $100. I'm not sure how my dog eating so much grass contributes to me promoting Underdog, but um, th th there you go. She's eating a lot of grass. <laughs> Idiot. We've got the final play-in yet to go in the West, but we've got to get through these East play-in games first. I mean, LeBron is on this all-time Heat squad, but the 76ers are much deeper. And looks like that depth is going to pay off. It wasn't a blowout, but it wasn't a tight finish either. Nine points for a Philly in the win. Man, LeBron, 29-7-7, seven and seven, somehow wasn't enough. Speaking of goats potentially coming up short in the play-in, MJ and the Bulls were in trouble. The all-time Hawks with a one-point lead here. Every possession is so pivotal. Duh, pivotal. Derrick Rose going to work on Trey. Yeah, that's prime D-Rose. The all-time Hawks are kind of, they're a pretty fun squad. I think on paper, especially with 99, Michael Jordan, the Bulls are better. But again, these play and matchups are crazy. Pete Maravich Mitch, uh, misses. Dominique's on the finish though. That works. Yo, Loki, my boy Mike wasn't boxing out there. Okay, can Dominique box him on the defensive end? That is a tough pull-up jump shot, but that's Michael Jordan's game, baby. Back and forth each possession. Uh, Jimmy Butler back in Chicago. That is defense, my guy. One of Jimmy's squads has already lost the all-time heat 
deep, but with the all-time bulls, he's going to work. Pete Maravich playing defense on the other. Oh my gosh, Pete Maravich with two blocks. What? There is technically a shot clock, but it's a one second differential. They, they could take the final shot this game. Looks like they're not going to go to their current day leader, Trey Young. It's Pete Maravich from the wing. He misses another in the clutch. Oh my gosh, Michael Jordan just missed a free throw. I, I mean, he hit one, which is key. It's a two point game, 2.3 seconds left. Can the Hawks get a good shot here? They're going to inbound it to Pete Maravich again. Wow, that's space. No, nope. That's space and Pete misses a third triple in the clutch. Man, why do you not go to Trey in that spot, dude? To the final West playoff spot, the all-time Kings would narrowly hold on against the scrappy all-time Pels. Zion Williamson at 24 points, but his boys were eliminated. Probably embarrassed their first matchup went down to the wire. Michael Jordan did not mess around. 35 points for the all-time Bulls as LeBron and the Heat were eliminated. Honestly, a couple pretty tough matchups for the all-time Heat there with the 76ers and Bulls. It doesn't matter. We've got our final 16 team set and there are some doozy matchups, dude. I'm not going to go through each one now because... Well, you know, let's just see how they start to unfold and see where those storylines are at. Should we get home with it then? In a battle of possibly the two weakest all-time teams remaining, the Clippers would sweep Dallas? Speaking of sweeps, however, it was the all-time Milwaukee Bucks handling business. This was no rivalry. This was not close. I mean, we kind of saw this coming with uh, Paul George, Mel Daniels, Reggie Miller, Tyrese Halliburton going up against Kareem Giannis, all them all-time Bucks. Nah, it was never going to be close. But look at this series right here. Boston is up 3-1 on Mike and the all-time Bulls. Yeah, Boston is so stacked. But MJ is MJ. Can he mount a comeback here? He's on the road to, oh my, the Celtics are going to close this thing out, aren't they? Ah, uh, yes, they are. To answer my own question, um, in convincing fashion to do, uh, man, that <laughs> we were loading one other potential 3-1 series comeback, OKC, Sacramento. Again, though, with the strength of the uh, all-time Thunder, I'm not holding my breath for the uh, Kings here. And with a late fourth quarter push, it's not a blowout, but but it's a W for OKC. But from there, we've got four series that are currently 3-2, meaning, um, yeah, anything can happen. And we'll start with the all-time Cavs taking on the all-time Magic. LeBron squad does have the 3-2 series lead in this case. One or two buckets here from the Magic, and this game's over. T-Mac, no hesitation. I think that's a dagger. Anyways, that series has been pushed to seven, like this one might be. The all-time Suns are up 3-2 on the T-Wolves. And another one's gonna go the distance. An emphatic 17-point win for Mini. But I say the best for last, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I'm just assuming anyways, there's a lot of people with hate in their heart. For the LA Lakers who are currently down 3-2, can Denver, if Denver closes this out, we've lost the Lakers and the Warriors, two heavyweights from the West. Anyways, the Lakers going to work one or two buckets here in the clutch. This game, wow, who just sold Kobe? Maybe you want to get the ball into Nikola hey, Jokic. He, he, he owns this poverty Lakers franchise. Wait a minute, mellow in the clutch. The all-time Lakers getting into their action. It's Jerry coming off the screen again. Kobe's not passing this time. Kobe won. Kobe wants the dagger. A terrible look from three. I mean, I'm just assuming, but even staunch Laker haters, you, you hate to see Kobe coming up short in the clutch. I mean, that's just not right. Six seconds left. Mello going to work. He's matched up with Elgin Baylor. Looked like he had a lane. He's going to pull up, though, and he's going to hit the shot. No way. All these legends on the court, and it's Carmelo Anthony shining the brightest. There's still one second left. Kobe's open. Pass it to him. Pass it to him. Dude, Pow didn't pass it to Kobe. It's over. Bryant for the win. And he hit it. Kobe Bryant just hit it. Kobe Bryant just hit it. Did I doubt Kobe Bryant? What are we seeing? Greatness. Um, yeah. Rarely am I genuinely speechless making these videos. Sorry, I didn't yell and, and get excited. I, I I still can't believe Kobe just hit that shot. Let's just move on for now. Game seven, Cavs magic. And no chaotics in the clutch here. The all-time Cavaliers are going to survive. We're back to the Suns Timberwolves series. I just, does any of this matter? We got to get back to Nuggets Lakers. I'm sorry. That's the only thing that matters after that Kobe shot. Wow. Wow. An the okay. All right. This one's shocking. The Timberwolves just did it. They just beat the Suns. Kevin Garnett had a monster game. They have four players 90 overall or better. That is that. That's it. Okay. I completely neglected this series earlier. I don't know why. I, I don't know how I miss this. This is a game seven. All time Knicks, all time 76ers. Last one before we get back to Kobe and the Lakers against the Jokic and the Nuggets. I can't even talk right now. <laughs> I didn't even show the final seconds of the sim. Uh, the 76ers blew out the Knicks. Okay. Okay. We have one final spot remaining in the second round of the NBA playoffs with our all-time teams. Kobe Bryant hit one of the greatest shots I've ever seen in 2K after Melo, I thought, had a game
game winner. What does game seven have in store for us? Oh my gosh. The Nuggets are up 25, 6, 26 points at half, 24 points at half. What is happening, LA? I, I mean, I, th this is wildly anticlimactic. After that game six finish, I can't believe we've got a blowout in game seven. And I also cannot believe it's the Denver Nuggets. They did it. They survived. And just like that, we've got the second round set. And look at the West, dude. The one, two, three, four seeds. That's from the current day. Their all-time teams came through. That's like that. That's crazy. It also almost happened in the East as it's the one versus four Boston, Cleveland, Milwaukee. The 76ers, the only team causing some chaos right now. That is why I can't believe this is happening right now. Just to check in after the first round, T Mac went nuts 26 points, 10 assists per game, but in a losing effort. Uh, Bob McAdoo has been amazing for the Clippers. KG, he's the reason Mini won. And honestly, the West, I cannot overstate how great the Golden State Warriors and LA Lakers all time teams are on paper. Probably the two best in the game, and they're both eliminated. That is nuts. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, Boston. I'm, I'm sorry. All right. I'm sorry, you're probably one of the top two best all-time team. I'm sorry I disrespected you another sweep. Okay. Wait, what, what is the the East? <laughs> um, the East is chalk, brother. Uh, the 76ers with a sweep. That's not even close. Anyways, that was anticlimactic, but we'll get to the East Finals here in due time. Boston, Philly, of course. Oh, and over in the West, it's it, it's really about to be the one and two seeds. OKC and Denver are up 3-1 respectively. Can we get some chaos in this round, please? It is so ironic. Denver, I, I feel like they're such a mid all-time team with all due respect but they are just they are performing so well in this video it's like they know what's going on in the current day i think minnesota is pushing this to a game six but with 30 seconds left it's only a two-point game we gotta watch this oh that's carmelo it's kg can you play defense no anthony edwards on the floor so the go-to is it's obviously kg yep right over dan Issel. he missed it oh he what he didn't get the rebound the nuggets they're going to mellow yep he's been clutched three seconds two seconds fading for the win carmelo <laughs> Again, you've got to be kidding me right now, dude. Mello with 34, 5, and 8. He, he's literally just running this video right now. Will Mello and the Nuggets be taking on the Thunder with a 3-1 series lead, or do we have another 2016-esque collapse incoming? Okay, well, I'm sorry I even put that in the universe there, uh, Thunder fans. Your boys should be okay here unless we get some after Blake Griffin for three. But in this economy, nah, nah, the Clippers are unserious. Our final four is set, and I can't lie, the West is crazy. Thunder, Nuggets, I did not see that coming. In the East, the Celtics 76ers. Yeah, that was pretty predictable. I can't lie. Kevin Durant is leading the way for the Thunder. 20.6 assists per game. Shea, like, Russ's numbers are pretty modest, but in a closeout game five, he dominates. They'll be taking, holy, look at the depth on this Nuggets team. Kiki's averaging a lot. They have so many people in double figures, but this is all mellow, dude. 22, six and six. He's hitting game winners every other game. Uh, yeah, like I said, the East, not, not, not surprising. Uh, we knew the Celtics would be amazing. Yo, shout out to Jason Tatum. Only getting 17 minutes a night, but pouring it in 14 points a game. While for the 76ers, hold on, is Joe, oh, Joel's not getting very much run. He's behind Moses Malone, I guess, fair enough. They look good too, man. Beginning in the East Finals, Boston finally had blood spilled as Moses Malone led Philly to a two-point game on victory. The loaded Celts were quick to return serve in game two, led by 32 and 11 from Larry Bird. They got 26 and 14 from Bill Russell in a game three win, and finally 19 and 15 from Bob Cousy to go up 3-1 in the series. It's just like, that's, too, there's, there's too many. There's too many Celtics all, all being great and legendary, dude. While I tried making a 3-1 series interesting over in the West, well, let's just cut right to the chase. The all-time Denver Nuggets swept the all-time Thunder. It's just like, I, I don't, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, th so that happened. Sometimes I just got, I, I need to look again. I need this to make sense. So Jokic is very good. We know that. Carmelo Anthony's playing out of his mind. David Thompson had a big game there. You know what? Maybe I'm discrediting this Nuggets roster. I mean, they're deep with 90 plus overalls. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Fair enough. I, I mean, I still think the all-time Thunder are a bit better on paper. I don't know how it was a sweep, but yeah, it's more evenly matchup than the Nuggets Lakers was, for example. And it doesn't matter. Denver's beating everyone. Will they be able to beat the all-time Boston Celtics? Well, we might be finding that out in a second here, unless Philly can extend this series. Yeah, uh, they need to go. They need to go right now. The all-time 76. Wow, that was a dominant move by Moses. I couldn't even introduce what... Yeah, okay, now Philly is down too. Moses is just being a beast, but can he help get stops here against the Celtics? Larry Bur Oh, Larry just got clamped by Will. What are you doing? The door is open here for Philly, man. Is Allen Iverson going to pass? Yes, he is. Yes, he's going to find Moses right here. Yes, he is. I saw it coming. 
and one. Moses is an animal. Philly has now made some changes. They've got Chuck Barkley out there. They've got Hal Greer defending. Oh, that's good defense. Wow, we might have an extended... Whoa, Allen Iverson in transition. <laughs> that was out of pocket. Sam Jones had an open three. Doesn't take it. Drives in against Moses. Bad idea. He gets Moses off his feet. Gets around him and misses. Wow. Uh, the Celtics still have a chance. I've seen some crazy stuff in this game. Oh, that's perfect. Larry in the corner for three. Of course. I He did. Yeah. Great, great set design. Of course, what I meant to say there was great inbound set or great play design. Um, set design? What are you talking about movies or what? Anyways, Philly, Allen Iverson for the win. Oh, he did it again. Yo, okay, okay, okay. Kobe hit that exact shot. Now Allen Iverson to keep the Sixers alive. Man, I still don't believe it, but Philly's back at home now trying to force a game seven. Uh, Boston, are you choking? No, no. Dang it, dude. Boston did not choke. A tight fit. Oh, Larry at the buzzer, just rubbing it in. And after all the dust settles from each conference, we're left with Celtics Nuggets in the finals. Um, I mean, that could very easily happen in real life. So that, so that says something, I guess. I'm not sure what it says, but we'll, we'll figure it out. Um, both teams have been great. The Nuggets have dropped one more game during their run than the Celtics. Uh, the Celtics, they're scoring about the same amount of points. The Celtics playing better defense. I kind of think the Nuggets run through the West was just easier because of the teams that lost early, the Lakers, the Warriors, but... I don't know. Maybe they can put up a fight against Boston. Well, yeah, I, I said maybe uh, um, the Celtics took game one of the finals by 32 points. Yeah, game two, more of the same, an 11 point victory to uh, take a stranglehold of the series in game three. They won by 18. Uh, it wasn't looking great. Uh, obviously, as we expected, Denver didn't even show up to the series until game four, where Denver came out and obliterated the Celts at 22 point victory victory on home court and uh, to stave off elimination once more Carmelo Anthony came through dropping 31 points in a game five nuggets dub and don't look now it's a 3-2 series oh my gosh Denver I got <laughs> once again I don't really have words Denver is the home team here as well they could really do this they are keeping up with Boston oh my I I I, I let the simcast go because it wasn't a tight game Denver just won they just won again they won a game six I, I don't even know what I did there. I failed to make it entertaining because I couldn't believe that Boston wasn't coming back in that game. It's 3-3. How did we, a 3-0 choke? No way. Denver would get out to an early lead in game seven in Boston, leading by five after the first quarter. That difference remained at the halftime break as Alex English and David Thompson, two OGs, were leading the way for the Nuggets. Led by Bill Russell, the all-time Celts made their inevitable push in the third, but yet Denver held strong. They are leading in the fourth quarter. Uh, I don't want to jinx anything. Oh, this is, no, Boston takes the lead. Oh, my, it, it do not get better than this, ladies and gentlemen. Two-point game, game seven. Boston, oh, they've been so good in the fourth. They made their run. Larry, Carmelo, you got to defend that entry pass. I hate that the CPU just defaults to that pick and roll. Like, how can you not defend it? Okay, okay. Denver is doing the exact same thing. Can Oh, see, Larry bumped Melo. That's how you defend it. Melo, don't force something up. Melo gets cut off by Larry. That's so many seconds in the key. He misses, and Jokic can't get the board over Bill. Okay, but the ball was out off of Bill Russell there. What are you doing? What was... Okay, all right. They just did that. Melo's pulling up for three. Oh my gosh. He has the... Yo, Melo has the ultimate green light. You can't really hate. He's been... Wait a minute. Speaking of ultimate green lights, Larry, why are you shooting that, my guy? This is not that. It is so sloppy and so chaotic. Melo, are you going to let Nikola Jokic touch the ball? Uh, no, he's not. No, he is... Dude, dude, they are doing it. Nikola Jokic is low-key open in the corner. Mello shooting this thing. Yeah, yeah, contested jumper. Oh, it's over. It's I can't believe it. If I couldn't see the Celtics choke, I wanted at least to see what Nikola Jokic could do out here, guiding the offense for Denver. But uh, Mello had other plans, and there it is. I simulated the NBA playoffs with current seeding, but put in all-time teams instead. Fittingly, we had the Denver Nuggets make a run out of the West to the NBA Finals. But in the end, it was would be the Boston Celtics after their magical in real life regular season coming out on top. Let me know what you thought of this video. I, I don't know. I just thought it might be fun. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Drop a thumbs up if you did. And uh, yeah, check out another video from here on my channel.